What's going on, everybody? I know it seems like I've been missing in action for the last little while, but you know, people fear that a politician does all this work and then all of a sudden, as soon as they're elected, they vanish, they ghost. Um, that's not the case. I did take some time away with my family just to recover after the six plus months of campaigning. And I just had to get away and just catch up on some sleep. I mean, there's so much stuff that went on and I really appreciate all of you guys supporting and helping me. I had to wind down my business. So after 20 years in the fitness industry, we have to make some pivots there. So I have to tear that down a little bit and uh, make some adjustments in that area. Last week we had our council orientation. So every day they brought in different departments from the city to help us reoriented to transit and to works and to arts and communications and economics. So we have a, a view of what's happening in Ward 9 from that perspective. They have like nice little booklets telling me everything about Ward 9 so I can help you and get some more data. Uh, also with that, we're constructing a new website. We want a website for Ward 9 to be something that is a one-stop shop for everything related to Ward 9 and the whole region as well. So when people ask questions, they can find a lot of the information they need on that website. There's a lot of preparation that goes into the, um, the swearing in and that becoming a part of the inauguration on the 16th. So November 15th, we do the inauguration and 16th will be our first day of council. And the next day after will be the first day of regional council. So all the preparation going to that as well. I'm still doing my Facebook. So my Facebook live chats on Wednesday night, the Wednesday night conversations have been very successful. Honored to have guests, excited to have some more guests on it as I've met people over the past few weeks. I want to answer all of your questions. I want it to be something that is very beneficial for you to be interactive with and also to learn it. So what's coming up? The new website mentioned that already. Uh, social media handles will stay the same. I'm going to continue with the same things because I'm still Martin Reed and this is still about Ward 9. So it wasn't just about trying to win a campaign. It's about governing and connecting still. And I, I want to keep saying that, that I really am about Ward 9 and I will work from Ward 9, City of Mississauga, Region Appeal, like concentric circles working out to address our needs and continue to work out from there. I'm building a funnel of communication. Last thing I want to mention that we have this funnel of communication I want to work on where we'll have our one-on-ones, we will do our virtual conversations of Facebook lives, we'll do listening tours where we will go to different neighborhoods and have round tables in a smaller setting. So the Plum Tree people, or the Settlers Green people, or the Maplewood people, for example, can be at Shelter Bay and like all these small neighborhoods that are very tight that we discovered, didn't discover, but we knew about, want to give them a voice and want to hear what's specific to your neighborhood. So we'll do listening tours. I want to take this time between the election and the swearing in to build, to learn, to listen and to prepare because I want all of us to be better every day.